Hi everyone. First, um, I'd like to share an update, especially to those people who have trouble installing the Star application. I dropped the link of the R packages in my description box below because we really need to install this first before we can um, we can successfully open the Star tool. I recently reformatted my laptop, so I had to reinstall it again. But then, our, uh, just like what have you experienced, whenever we access the ERI website, we were always denied. So yeah, I emailed them, and thankfully, unfortunately, they give me their link for this, uh, for the R package link. So yeah, you can check it on my description box below. Okay, so anyway, now I'm going to show you how to choose multiple comparison methods or um, what we call the post hoc analysis. So I have my data here. The post hoc procedure is commonly used when we have three or more factor levels. As you can see, my treatment here has no modified levels. So this is just for, uh, for the sake of having an example. We will analyze our data first. Okay, we now have our input window. We arrive ANOVA and we also have pairwise mean comparison of treatment. That one. So every factor has this, this kind of table, the pairwise mean comparison. But if you really want to modify or you want to try DMRT, SNK, or Tukit test or any other comparison test, then we should go back to this input window and this tab will pop up. Click post hoc and then after that, you can select response variables you want to analyze. You can check more than one test. So for now, I'll just choose DMRT. Now you have the output for the DMRT comparison. You can do this also on your own because this is just this is just so easy. Yeah, thank you.